In what world is a 225 pound bench press normal? In the world of serious athletes or people that lift weights somewhat seriously, be that recreationally or competitively, being able to lift 225 pounds on the bench press is pretty normal. However, for the general population, it is incredibly abnormal. It is not normal to be able to bench press 225. Now, according to this, about 1.3 million Americans can bench press 225 pounds or 0.4% of the population. And this is a very small percentage of the population. And also, I want to point this out. The United States of America is a very well-developed country. More people have access to weights, food, and supplementation. So there's going to be probably more Americans on average than most countries that can bench press 225. Now, here's the thing. If we're asking how many people can bench press 225 pounds, I think we should be caring about the people that actually lift weights seriously, not the guy who doesn't train at all, the completely untrained person. Why should I care if so-and-so that doesn't exercise can't bench press 225 pounds? Why does that matter? It doesn't matter. And here's the thing. For healthy, grown men, the overwhelming majority of you should be able to train yourselves up to bench pressing 225 pounds. The only real exceptions to this are going to be people that are just very, very small. So if you're naturally under 150 pounds, and of course the smaller you get, it might be very, very difficult to get to a 225 pound bench press. And it's not impossible, but it is difficult. As for teenagers, if you're like, 13, 14 years old, don't sweat it. Just keep lifting. Once you get to 17 and 18 years old, if you've been lifting two to three years and you're not tiny, that 225 bench press should be in reach for you. And that's the point that I want to make is 225 bench press. It is a milestone. It is something to be proud of. And if you're not there yet, don't sweat it. You will get there. However, at the same time, it's not this extraordinary achievement that is just beyond most people because they don't have the genetics to achieve this. The only people that do not have the genetics to achieve this are people with disabilities, which would prevent them. Incredibly small people. Most women, even though there are actually quite a few women in competitive powerlifting that can bench press 225 pounds. But the rest of us we can do this. It just takes time and effort and probably bench pressing with proper powerlifting technique will get you there the quickest. And if you're doing it two to three times a week and at the end of the day, you should be able to get there. Now, once we get into numbers like 250, 275, 300 pounds, that's when I start to admit that yes, some of us genetically are not meant to get to that level. A lot of us are, and a lot of us will not get close to our genetic potential, especially in a specific lift. For example, myself, I am a soccer player. Bench press is not a high priority for me. My best ever bench press is 275 pounds. That was in a powerlifting meet to powerlifting standards. I probably have the genetic potential to get up to 300, 315 pounds but I bench press maybe once every other week. So I'm probably never going to get to my genetic potential on the bench press. But if I were to prioritize it, I could. And if you really want to get good at bench press, that's what you need to do. You need to make sure that you're doing it two to three times a week. You're working on making your form as proficient as possible and getting adequate volume and recovery. Once you put, get this down, getting to 225 is going to be nothing. You should be able to get to 250, and you may even be able to get to the 275 and 300 range. Everybody out there, good luck.